and welcome everybody here in Twitch chat and everybody on YouTube for some Teemo Wayfinder. Uh, we're going to go ahead and play this awesome deck. This is, you know, one of my favorite decks to play. It's not really exactly a meme deck, even though it's meme tier Monday, but we just had the three meme decks here and, you know, want to fill out the uh, schedule for the day. But what this deck is trying to do is play as many Teemos as possible and give as the opponent as many Puff Caps as possible. So we're trying to actually win games on Puff Caps. A lot of decks that play Teemo are just like aggro decks that play it for the one mana, one one elusives that you know will maybe do an extra point of damage or two with the Puff Caps. But this deck is um, specifically built to win on Puff Caps. All right, so besides Teemo, so because of that, so besides Teemo, we got Puff Cap Peddler, and chump wump so we got other ways to give our opponents puff caps but then of course we are trying a kinku wayfinder to get extra teemos in play so try to level up teemo to get it to level two get multiple and then you start doubling them we also have the dawn and dusks where we can get multiple copies of teemos because we're an ionia deck we got karmas at the top end where karma can just get us more spells let us play a longer game uh, so we don't just run out of stuff and also if we have an enlightened karma then our um mushroom clouds will be doubled to be able to give more puff caps i'm trying one new thing today like before we had 24 and and 16 for 24 ionia 16 pnz the last time we played this so it was 60 percent ionia i'm trying what i'm gonna try one counterfeit copies though so we're going a little bit under 60 percent um ionia and if we counterfeit copies Teemo, which is what we want to do, then we are putting a lot more PNZ into the deck. So we'll make Wayfinder harder to hit. But um, so many times when we play this, like if we have a Wayfinder hit two Teemos and then they kill my Teemos um, or people just you know kill the Teemos, then like the other Wayfinders don't do anything. We can't draw more Teemos. I want to try just one counterfeit copies to put more Teemos in the deck. So like a second Wayfinder can still put more Teemos into play. It may not be good, but you know it's meme tier Monday. We're gonna try out, try it out. But you know, you know that's that's basically what we're doing there. Oh no, I just cut something. Jump on, come back. All right, so here we go. I mean, ideally, I would like ideally we would have more. And we'll just play this still. We would have more Ionia and have more allegiance for Ionia, so we hit Wayfinder more often. But that's just so hard to do um, whenever we're focused on winning with Puff Caps. Um, like, we do need these PNZ cards also. All right, Teemo Wayfinder. All right, so not turn one Teemo. Against Garen, Fiora, Will of Ionia seems really good against Fiora. Uh, I want to keep that one. Um, we'll get rid of Twin Disciplines, and I kind of want to just get rid of Get Excited to look for, like, Teemo and other stuff. Well, the good news is we have a Wayfinder that can put multiple Teemos into play. The bad news is I kind of do just have all Ionia cards right now. So we're looking at like a 50-50 proposition. Keep on drawing these Ionia cards. Consider bounce, considering bouncing that, but no, I don't think we do. Alright, well, good thing our Shadow Assassin drew the Chump Womp, because the Chump Womp was going to miss. That would have missed also. 
Um. So obviously it's good to get Wayfinder in play, but I, I kind of want to chump lump first and give them like the two mushroom clouds so that then if we hit two Teemos and attack them, the first one, um, yeah, I kind of want to do that. They had a really good hand. All these one and two mana cards that are super impactful. And then Bannerman. Get excited. I would have whiffed again on the Wayfinder. If I would have played Wayfinder last turn, I would have whiffed. I would have hit this turn. All right, come on. No! Darn. Yeah, it's just game. It would have been a huge long shot for us to win that even if we would have hit. But then after the Scythria, it's... probably was just game no matter what. Yeah, their hand was awesome. It was pretty perfect. Oh well. Alright, next game. Bunch of aggro stuff. Too slow. Give me a Teemo. No. Well, we went 5-0 with Catastrophe, but since then, Legends of Runeterra has not been liking us. You know, like, the last game we wanted a bunch of Starless Seers, this game we won a bunch of Teemos. They've not been giving them to us. I don't want them to kill my Teemo, though. Can we get away with playing, like, Peddler? I feel like they're gonna, you know, Katarina or Draven. I feel like if I would have played the um, Teemo right away, that they would have played Katarina and had Blade's Edge. Which they still can, I suppose, but I guess it's a, it's a lower chance that they have Katarina instead of Draven. Hey, what's up, Maximus? Oh, yeah, Maniac, you started right at the Seer Trindamir time. Yeah, we. Our Catastrophe deck was awesome. You missed out on that one. Tell me masks, tell me tail, stop to die. Smile, it's called gunplay. Oh, whoops, it 
am I right? What? They have to have removal for Teemo, right? Oh, I don't know why I'm not attacking with this thing, too. Um, I guess... I guess they could have Whirling Death. Whirling Death would be bad. Alright. No, don't draw the two Puff Caps yet. Let me double them up first. No. Alright, well. We tried. Unfortunately, I drew the counterfeit copies after playing Teemo. So that didn't help out too much. That wasn't a good order. Awesome, Maximus. Glad you're enjoying the game. Awesome. All right, so Karma is just definitely good. Yeah, I think we're just, just going to play Karma and get more more Karmas in hand. Or, like, put more Karmas in the deck. Play a Karma. I don't like that at all. Drew that. So Wayfinder should have a better chance of hitting because we just put four, you know, we just shuffled four Karmas into the deck. So come on. No! Wayfinder still missed. No. We're going to have two more Teemos and they were already leveled up. I don't have the mana. What signs without the Everything's going wrong. It's a bit thermogenic beam. Should have been an Ionia card. Seventeen puff caps. Hmm. Next card down. If I would have led with Shadow Assassin first, and then played Wayfinder, we would have hit it. But obviously, like you know, how, how are we supposed to know that? Probably go to uh, 
four. Not go to four. I was gonna say they already cast a million get excited. So I was thinking they probably didn't have another get excited, but I guess they had elixir of wrath. Dang. Wayfinder has just been, you know, just been whiffing. I really think if we would have hit the Wayfinder there, we probably would have won. You know, our, we already almost killed our opponent, like, just that extra damage that those those two twos would have done. And then I would have had, like, the Mystic Shots to go upstairs. Timo! And we have the copies for the Timo. Guess it's kind of better to lead Timo into Green Glade Duo and stuff like that. So this is like a, a worse curve. Now we have more Teemos. I would have led with Green Glade Duo. I was planning on leading with Green Glade Duo here, by the way. Um, but then we drew the other Teemo. <clears throat> but I was going to be going with Green Glade Duo on turn two. Last game, um, you know, we put all those Karmas in play. All we needed was just an Ionia card on top. This game, or like in our deck, this game we put all those Teemos in our deck, and that's all we can draw. We draw nothing but Teemo. Wow. That's what we call a jerk move right there. That is a jerk move. I think I want to get some free spells here with Karma. Mind, no free spells. I've cleaned up a lot of the stuff they had, though. I mean, I did. I did put four extra copies of Teemos into my deck, so that certainly helped. <laughs> never see us coming. 
that helped how we drew so many champions. All right, we doubled it up. 28. Keep it going, Teemo. Just drew one for now. Okay, what are we blocking? That's not attacking, that's not attacking, that's not attacking. Okay. Just changing the order. Giving that thing ephemeral. No, let's go move into negative one. I have to block with Teemo. Ugh. Oh, block with Teemo. Where are you going? Let's be down to two. So we need to draw a Kinku Wayfinder that puts two Teemos into play or a Dawn and Dusk that puts two Teemos into play. You've got to be kidding me. Opponent is the biggest jerk. Oh, that's a Their deck has like three total removal spells and they drew two of them to kill two Teemos. Or no, they killed the Karma. The other one, but. All right, uh, Wayfinder. Yeah, I was giving myself a chance to win with the Teemo, yeah. Wayfinder. Oh, we would have the Dawn and Dusk. Oh, man. Oh, we would have had Dawn and Dusk. If they didn't have that second single combat, man, that was so unfortunate. Because then we would have, like, like they would have been dead. Because they would have taken six from Teemos to put them down to five. Like, first of all. Come on, draw, draw some puff caps. Let's go. Come on. Get a bunch of them. Just one. Yeah, we'll get three random cards if this works. No. I think I draw ten ten puff caps. They definitely deserve it. Uh after Bra Mimo waving by. They definitely deserve getting ten puff caps. I have done I've done really well with this deck quite a bit, but um, last time we played the this deck and this time, so like these last two times have been two bad runs for the deck. Our wayfinders are just always missing. We never get like you know, like we haven't wayfindered in Teemos at all in any of these games. I know, right? Yeah, Braum waving somebody who's playing a Teemo Wayfinder deck. It's like, congratulations. We've had some people like that today. Like earlier, somebody did that like against our Poros deck. Yeah, we're playing Poros. Like, are you kidding me? And they were playing, you know, like, Spider Karma, like a, a really good...
quality deck. Ridiculous. To get excited that I would probably have to discard the twin disciplines. I would love to wait till we have Chump Womp before I play this to discard one of those things. Maybe I discard Will of Ionia? I'm killing Callista. Which of these am I discarding? Let's let's try it. Mm. I guess if I do go Wayfinder and get a couple Teemos, they probably play like a singular spider and then flip Elise. Probably attack and kill my Teemos before I can Will of Ionia the Elise. Well they would they would just replay it anyway. Only costs two mana. Play this first, which I guess means I should have just gone straight to attacks, because I'm not. I don't know if I need to attack with that. I guess we could attack with it. I mean, they're they're. I don't think they're an ephemeral deck. Yeah, I mean, they could have Skitter, but. All right, we're going for double leveled up Teemo this next turn. They got six, you know, we got them the 16 puff caps. And so the, the Teemos will be leveled up. Come on, Wayfinder. Yes! Wayfinder hit! Finally! Finally! Let's go, Teemo! Double these up. We go to 32, 64. If they both hit, goes to 64. More mushrooms. 
All right, so we only have the one Teemo left in the deck if we Wayfinder again. All right, we finally did the thing. It's probably the turn to play a Karma. I've drawn a lot of those. I can cast William to bounce Callista. That card's also kind of annoying. Maybe I bounce Darkwater Scourge. Not let them gain five life. That's probably the thing to do. To bounce the Scourge. No, they're not going to death mark it. I'll take care of this. They're not going to death mark it. They don't have death mark. They don't have that card. That would be bad for me if they had that. So they don't have it. Puppy, they don't have it. No, they don't have it. No, just play Glimpse Beyond. Deny. Oh, that's worse. That's worse for me. Alright, back to doing 13 damage now. That's a good one. All right, so eight mana. Come on, Wayfinder. No! Didn't get the last emo. Oh, I shouldn't be doing this. Oh, no, wait. Okay, I was thinking, like, Callista's Black Spear. Hey, come over here, Harvey. Stop. Stop clawing at the chair. Come over here. I can pet you with my left hand. Um, I was thinking, like, Callista's Black Spear, but they probably won't have a Black Spear. Uh, what would happen if we chose a card to start in our hand each game? That would be... That'd probably be too good. I will play my part. Yeah, like that would... That would just make the decks just too consistent. They're already very consistent in this game with the mulligan system as is. You just have decks be too consistent and you'd, you'd honestly just get bored of playing after a while because you would just play like everybody would have like their one drop their two you know their powerful champion on turn two like they would always have like a lease on turn two or, or whatever like it just the games would just be too repetitive Yeah, definitely ritualing. Oh no! Ugh. Oh, that thing's slow speed? I can't even cast this in combat? Oh no. How did everything go so wrong? Yeah, I was not... I mean, that was definitely my plan, was to play this card. 
Uh, but I guess I should have, because it had the draw one anyway, I guess I just should have then. I was kind of leaving myself just the ability to, like, if I needed to, cast this inside of Aegis and see what happens, but... That's a tilt. Man, I am on tilt. That was rough. Karma, you are not helping. All right, I guess we're just going to be playing control deck here. Um, I like keeping P and Z cards in hand in the opener. That gives Wayfinder, you know, that gives Wayfinder a better chance. Uh, we don't really need to draw Karma right away. Hmm. Think you're fast. Do I maybe need more thermogenic beams? Maybe I need to copy the beam. Um, I'm not exactly sure with the the whole riot ID I uh, riot ID stuff. I think maybe you find that like it on the main page, like up in the top right hand corner somewhere. But I'm not sure. Oh, there's a social tab. Maybe it's on a social tab. I don't, I don't know. I've I've never yeah I've never looked into that at all. So, I, so I'm not the one to ask. So yeah, I I would believe Baba there. I'm gonna put more thermogenic beams back. In. We're going to need those to kill Yasuo's. Don't let the fluffy tails fool you. That was a really bad card for me to see, and I wish I would have thermogenic beamed one of these now. So they have Steel Tempest. Steel Tempest is rough. Yay, no Steel Tempest. Well, if they have Yasuo, I don't get to Karma Thermogenic Beam. So we'll Wayfinder Thermogenic Beam. Come on, Wayfinder. Yes. Yes. Wayfinder finally hitting. I need this to resolve. I need them not to have a deny or protection or anything. I need this to resolve. Well, I guess I guess we have double mystic shot now as our prayer at killing Yasuo before they start killing all these things.
I don't think stun and recall is burst speed. I think we'll be able to respond. Whoa! Let's go! Alright, up to 30. It's happening. Man, if we could hit them again with all of those. And, you know, have it go to 60, 120, 240. That'd be crazy. Ooh, I like it. I like that deny. My best that I've ever done with Puff Caps is giving them 680, and they drew 43, I think. Alright, well, one. I mean, do I even have to deny that? I mean, I guess I, it's possible I don't even have to deny that. I'm not really blocking with those things anyway. Well, I guess I should because of these things. It's not smart to play stuff pre-combat against the, the Yone deck, the Intimidating Roar deck, even though, um, 224, even though I would rather, you know, play the Chump Lump first and give them, you know, 10 more Puff Caps before double, 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 but... Alright, we need them to draw 7. What does that do? I guess grows those things. Ah, uh, Wayfinder missed. <laughs> it's possible Wayfinder hit. Oh, six. No. Well, I'm glad we got a, a blocker. Man, six, come on. No. Man. Team of Wayfinder. All right, so what we learned here today is that counterfeit copies is the worst card. So, got to take team... Got to take counterfeit copies out, because that was obviously the really bad luck. Uh, that was the card that was the terrible luck. Um, need to get another Ionia card back in here. Um, could play Kinku Life Blade. Bleh. Could play Spirits Refuge.
Could play Jewel Protector. Uh, make a 4 4 Teemo. Um, could have the Stand United. I've been doing some Stand United. Stand United's not bad. I think I'll just go back to that. Could just have like a the the Imperion or Windfarer Hatchling. Something like that. Something big. Maybe a Yone to try to play some defense. Dang. That was rough. Yeah, I mean, so, like, the first, like, three or four times I played this deck, we had winning records every single time, and the deck was good. But then the last two times we played it, we didn't do good. Uh, I don't think there's an Ionia card that gives plus three, plus zero, and lifesteal. I could play, like, a Recall. Like, where they, they kill Teemo and I bounce it back to my hand. Maybe that's a card to play. It's just recall. Whenever we're trying to recall a, a one mana thing, and I can, I can also recall wait. Like if if Wayfinder on turn four misses, I can try Wayfinder again on turn five. I don't know. So is like is recall good? Necrolepsy, fourteen months, aka fourteen years. Thank you, Necrolepsy. Our third sub of the day. There's just not any, like, these other cards that I really want to play too much. Yeah, maybe, maybe it's just Recall. Yeah, worse, it's like a four it's like a four mana shadow assassin. I mean, well that's not at worst, but you know, we can bounce shadow assassin. It does let us like throw a Teemo in as like a blocker and then recall it, then replay it. So basically, you know, with that combo, we can it's like two mana steel tempest, kind of. If you want to think of it like that. It's like a two mana steel tempest. Uh this is it. This is this is the deck that I that this is like my favorite deck to play. I know we just went 05, but um The newer metagame, you know, like we've played this deck for a while, for you know, like six weeks or so. Uh, you know, six weeks, two months, something like that. The newer metagame definitely seems more difficult to beat, especially with, like, all of these Shadow Owls decks that are fast and have, like, the interaction, you know, like, the the Cursed Keeper, um, you know, Cursed Keeper plus the zero mana 3-2 sack it, make more 4-4s four and all that kind of stuff, like Callista decks. Callista's really good. Um, but... Anyway, that's Teemu Wayfinder. Still fun uh, meme tier Monday today, especially the Catastrophe deck. Man, going 5-0 with the Catastrophe deck, that was crazy. That was awesome. Um, but, uh, yeah, so those of y'all watching on YouTube, you know, hit that like button over there. And let me know what you think of, like, what what would you play instead of, you know, this recall? Like, which which Ionia card would you put in here? I don't, you know, I don't, I don't know what. Like, maybe Stan United... I don't, I don't know what to play in this slot. Nothing, nothing's uh, jumping out at me. But yeah, so feel free to let me know in the comments over there. But anyway, thank you so much for watching some Team of Wayfinder, and I'll see you for the next video.